लिस्निंग एक्टिविटी थ्री द लॉस्ट नेकलेस वॉट विल यू डू वेन यू लूज योर पेन और अ बुक डू यू सस्पेक्ट सम वन ऑफ स्टेलिंग इट वॉट विल बी योर फीलिंग वेन यू कम टू नो दैट द पर्सन यू सस्पेक्टेड हैज नॉट टेकन इट Here is such a situation. Listen to it. One morning Mrs Pratap or rich lady found her expensive gold necklace missing. She looked for it in every room in her house but did not find it. Then she thought of Mr Seo. Mr Seo was a very clever man. He often helped people to find missing things. Mr Seo lived in a neighboring street. Mrs Pratap went to see him in his house. Mr Seo, I lost my gold necklace and can't find it. Please help me to find it, she said. Where did you lose it? asked Mr Seo. In my house. answered mrs pratap all right said mr seo let's go there in a few minutes they were at mrs pratap's house mr seo went round the house and looked into all the rooms then he came back to mrs pratap and said now please answer my question mrs pratap said all right When did you last wear the necklace? asked Mr Seo. I wore it yesterday morning, said Mrs Pratap. I went by taxi to a friend's house. I stayed there for about 2 hours and came back at noon. Then I took off the necklace and put it on the shelf in my bedroom. When did you see the necklace again? Mr Seo asked. I saw it late in the evening. It was on the same shelf said Mrs Pratap I wanted to put it back in my box but I forgot Have you any guests in the house asked Mr Seo Yes I have said Mrs Pratap My nephew and niece are staying with me Mr Seo then said Let me see your bedroom once again Mrs Pratap took him to her bedroom. Mr Seo first looked at the shelf in the room. Then he walked round the room. He stood near the window and asked, "What time did you open this window in the morning?" "At 6 o'clock," said Mrs Pratap. "When did you find the necklace missing?" asked Mr Seo. At eight o'clock," answered Mrs. Pratap. "Did any of your servants come into this room this morning?" "Yes," said Mrs. Pratap. "The maid servant did, but she came at half past eight, and she is an honest woman." Mr. Seo wrote down all Mrs. Pratap's answers in a small notebook. He then stood near the window and looked out for some time. Then he said, "Excuse me, Mrs. Pratap. I'll be back in a minute." He quickly walked out of the house. Mrs. Pratap stood at the window and looked out. Mr. Seo climbed a tree and stood on a branch. There was a crow's nest on it. Mr. Seo put his hand into the nest. and took out something it was mrs pratap's necklace mr seo gave the necklace to mrs pratap she was very happy please be careful and don't lose it again said mr seo don't leave any of your jewels on the shelf a crow can fly in through the window and take it away mrs pratap said Thank you very much Mr Seo
I will. Having listened to the story of the lost necklace, let us now complete the following paragraph based on your listening of the story. Number 1. 